Hey guys, what's up? In today's video, I am showing you another pin haul. Hey guys, if you're new, my name is Brittany. In today's video, I am showing you some of my most recent pin purchases. Now, these are two different purchases that I bought on two different Instagram live sales. Pin live sales are becoming the death of me, I swear. I have quite a few pins today, so let's hop on into it. All right, so this first one I was really excited to get. It was from kind of a series, I guess it was a series, and it was to celebrate the 30th anniversary, and they had all different kinds of characters on this backing card, and there would come three pins on the backing card. So, um, the seller for this sale just cut each pin off on its own separate backing card and this one is obviously Wreck-It Ralph with Vanellope. I love it. I love his face. Her face too, but he just looks so darling and I really don't have many Wreck-It Ralph pins so I was really excited to get him. I got two more from the same set so you can kind of get an idea if you've never seen it before. So you would take, these actually aren't from the same backing card, but they actually all like work like a puzzle piece as if they did. So this is how you would purchase it. And it was originally 20 bucks, which I think is a steal for these three pins. The next one I got was this Note Games from <laughs> Incredibles. Edna Mode is definitely one of my most favorite characters in Disney movies. I love her. I love everything she stands for, her attitude everything and of course she's amazing at fashion dolly. Next from that same little series I was really excited about getting him as well because I don't have many of him and it is Quasimodo from the Hunchback of Notre Dame. Next pin is this little itty bitty pin and it is this tiny Space Mountain pin uh, from Disney World. Who wants to focus? There we go. So it's got Mickey, Donald, and Goofy, and you can kind of see Goofy back there. His ears are blowing in the wind. That one I picked up for Liz, as well as this one. Actually, the next two we actually picked up for Liz. And the next one is, of course, Pegasus and Phil. As you guys know, if you are returning subscribers or viewers, Liz is a huge Hercules fan and a bigger Pegasus fan. So we had to get this little cute hidden Mickey. That was actually one of the parks I looked for a lot on cast members and that was really hard to find. Honestly, that whole little series, that little set of those hidden Mickeys of like the two characters together. But there was a bunch of different characters and they were super hard to find, especially Pegasus and Phil. Next one I picked up for Liz is this cute little Mickey sailor and it says Toon Disney Channel. <laughs> I got another Hidden Mickey, which I was actually really, really, really excited about. And I know my friend Jess over at Princess and the Sith would be so proud of me. I picked up, but I don't even know his name. Oh my gosh, I don't even know his name. But I picked up this guy from the Black Cauldron. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of the Black Cauldron, but I am a big fan of Disney movies in general. So. I am a true collector and I collect anything Disney and the Black Cauldron is something I don't have a, well any of really. So I was really happy that I saw this for sale because I just I needed something from the collection. I'm willing to get a couple more but um because it's not the worst movie just not like in my top favorite but I had to have this little guy to go in my pin collection. We got a couple more pins. This next one I am just like in awe over. Ah, I am falling in love with fantasy pins, you guys. I really, really am. So this next one is a Doom Buggy pin, and I saw these on Etsy, and I've seen a lot of other pin sellers selling these before, um, but oh my gosh, guys. This pin specifically, I was just like, oh, my heart, I need it! It is Dumbo. With all the crows, I don't know if they have a name because honestly, Dumbo again, I'm weird, is not another huge favorite of mine, but look at his face. I love elephants and I love Dumbo as a character, just don't love the movie. And he also has little Timothy Mouse. Look how huge he is. I mean, look at, let's, okay, let's compare. So this is the smallest pin I got. <laughs> this is the biggest pin. Oh my, my gosh, that's so funny. 
Holy moly. Anyway, so I love this. I will try and find the seller. Actually, I, I won't try. I know exactly who the seller is. So I will leave him in the comments below. He is the same one if you saw my golden book of the sword and the stone. That is the same maker, so I will leave his uh, Etsy shop in the description below. Speaking of golden book, I bought another one. This one's kind of technically for Liz, but it's also kind of technically mine. <laughs> so we both love Zootopia, and I was wanting to start collecting it. She kind of has a small collection. We don't really have our, se our separate collections. Like, there's stuff that she really likes and stuff I really like, and then there's stuff we both really like, so it's our collection. So it's for both of us. But we got the Zootopia Golden Book. I am just so in love with these golden books. I can't get over all of the detail. So again, this is a fantasy pin, so it's fan made, but it's just incredible. Next we have a little Mickey, and he is dressed up as a Dapper Dan. Now I actually have Goofy and Donald, so this is actually a four pin, um, I guess like a booster pack that you can get in the parks. And I found Goofy and I found Donald on cast members. So I have both of them already. And the only other one I'm missing is Pluto, which I'm not like racing to find because it's literally just Pluto. I mean, it's cute because he's like trying to sing or howl, but it's nothing special. I love how they're in these little outfits. So when I saw Mickey, I wanted him so in my eyes, the collection is kind of complete. If I come across Pluto really cheap or for a trade, then I'll probably get him. Otherwise, I'm not going to stress it too much because I got the cute little Dapper Dan. Next is the pin I was super excited to get, and that's Juju from Princess and the Frog. Now this pin, I don't know if how it technically came, if it was just like by itself or came in a, in a pack because I know that a lot of these pins, there's a lot of pins that came with the little footprint in the back um, and it was part of the fairy tales event. So I'm not really sure how they came. I'll see if I can find any information on it, but I love Juju. I love Princess and the Frog. I love Mama Odie so much. So I had to get little Juju. And the very last pin was actually what started my one sale that I went on. I clicked on it and the very first pin he held up was this one and I was like, I've been here for five seconds, sold. <laughs> and it is this really cool pin of Dr. Finkelstein and Igor. I was really excited for anything with Dr. Finkelstein, but I think it's so cool. I love when Disney characters are with Disney attractions. It's like my favorite thing. Or if they're dressed up as another character, but that's a whole other story. And that is actually it for my pin haul. Again, I'm so happy with all of the pins that I got today. I don't know why I'm so addicted to pins, you guys, but they make me so happy. I look at all of them and I just go, ooh, and it just makes me happy. I'm just gonna say, it's okay, Brittany, just have a little bit more self-control. But I like buying them. I like being able to show them to you guys. I know you guys, a lot of people get a kick out of seeing all my pins because I have way too many. But um, yeah, it's a lot of fun for me. So let me know in the comments below which one was your favorite. Also, make sure you check out all of my other pin mail that I've done and all my other magic mail I've done. I will leave the playlist in the description below. Make sure you go check that out. And if you aren't already, please hit that subscribe button and ring that notification bell. That way you can check out anytime I get more magic mail, pin subscription services, other Disney subscription services, or just other little fun things I do on my channel. Thanks guys so much for watching and as always, I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.